spontaneous vlog time. Hello. Hey guys. Amy and I made plans and then we were like, hold up, let's vlog today because first of all, we're gonna go shopping and second of all, I have another date tonight. Look at me, kind of hoeing around. <laughs> You have a busy weekend. I have a could be really busy weekend. all weekend, girl. Girl? Girl, I should be. Right now, we're going to Zara because we're going to do some shopping. And Zara's summer collection has been like killing Crazy. it. Like Crazy. Like killing it. I'll see you guys when we get to Zara. It's elimination round because my arm is getting too fucking tired of carrying all these clothes. It's really pretty. Peek of what I got, guys. Oh my god, let's Are tell them. Let's tell them what the fuck happened in line. Yeah. A little sneaky peeky. Sneakity peekity. I'll pick out something cute. I'll pick out something colorful. Sneakity peekity. Um, let me tell you what the fuck happened in line. Mimi and I, we both had things to return, and then we also had like a shitload of things to buy. So like, we knew that we were gonna be there for a while, but. The line was already long when we got into it. So like we were also waiting for yeah. other people. So then it's finally our turn and like obviously we're taking a little bit longer but like it's no one's doing anything wrong. We were just waiting. We weren't doing anything different. And these two women behind us, keep in mind like grown ass women. They were like making petty comments and being like, isn't there anyone else that could do this? Or like, can you guys open another register? And then like her and Mimi kind of got into like a silent beefing. <laughs> they were both like mumbling shit under their breath. <laughs> it was kind of funny. But um, yeah, that was the shit show that occurred at Zara. But it's okay. We both got cute ass things. Stay tuned for my haul! Okay. We are at Zakaya. I haven't been here in so long. It's, it's so good. I think this is like one of the best sushi restaurants in LA. It just hits. It just hits. Like you, you can't ever go wrong. Like you, you would never come to Izakaya and like have a bad meal. Wow. Appetizer number one. What are we eating? Spicy crispy albacore? It's albacore crispy onion. Crispy onion albacore. Mm -hmm. We already ate some. Oops. This meal. What? 10 out of 10. You know what you 10 out of 10. Never disappoints. Never. Very nice outfit you got going on. <laughs> I'm doing a haul <laughs> on my TikTok. So we're trying everything on. Why do you literally look like a mermaid right now? I'm dead ass. <laughs> like your hair is like Thanks. perfectly curled. Thanks, girl. Oh, hey. What's, what's on the schedule Bro, for I tonight? Bro, I Are you dressing warm? I don't, I don't know. <laughs> I just did a Zara haul on my TikTok. So I'm wearing a bunch of clothes that don't match. Hello? What do you want me to do, decide what? for you? Like, I don't understand. You're getting no, upset. No, I don't understand why What time is it? 6.30? My date is in, like, 45 minutes. This is a pre-date bowl. My date is in literally 10 minutes. I touched up my makeup just a little bit. Mimi's touching up my hair just a little bit. And yeah, I think we're going to the movies. What are you seeing? Um, oh, what was it called? Wrath of Man? Yeah. He seems pretty excited about it. <laughs> I don't even know what the movie's about. So. Just going for the popcorn. <laughs> Date night. Any minute, he could be texting me saying I'm here. Any minute now. Any minute, guys. Any, Any minute. minute. Any minute. I'm gonna wait. I'm gonna <laughs> The vlog cam. <laughs> this is Misha. This is Misha. I'm back from my date. I'm, I've been back. It's like 12 a.m. right now. I came home at like 10.30 or like 11. I think it was like 10.30. I'm not gonna say anything, you know, just for the sake of privacy. Yeah, I just did my makeup. Whoa, did, didn't do my makeup. I took my makeup off and I'm just relaxing, you know, like I'm just listening to music, like just vibing right now. 
I'm so tired. But tomorrow is a busy day. What am I doing tomorrow? What am I doing? What am I doing? I'm filming a video tomorrow. I'm filming a haul, all of that. And yeah, I'm quite excited. I'm gonna go to my sister's to film. What else am I doing? And then I'm just gonna edit and do homework. You know, like finals are coming up, APs are coming up. Really just need to like pull through for like another two, three weeks. Then we're chilling. We're chilling. Um, so. Yeah. Why did I sit down here? Oh, to tell you guys what I was doing. Oh, I needed that. Okay. Wow. Is my brain really not functioning right now? <laughs> like, did we not just have this conversation? <laughs> I'm also like talking to myself. This is this is like me making my to-do list for tomorrow, basically. Sunday's gonna be lit. Ew, why did I just say that? Sunday's gonna be really fun because first of all, it's Mother's Day. And then at night, it's Carla's younger brother's um, bar mitzvah. It's gonna be a hoot. A hoot. Anyway, I'm gonna go like listen to music and then go to bed. I'll see you in the morning. Good night. Hey y'all. What time is it? It's 10.45. I literally woke up at 9.30 and I was literally in bed from like 9.30 to now. Well, I don't know what I was doing. I'm wearing the same thing as I wore yesterday and I'm getting ready. I'm gonna film a haul at my sister's. So, yeah. Oh, I didn't know you were vlogging. You thought I was just talking to myself right now? I thought you were talking to me. You do this all the time. <laughs> no. Anyway, I'm on FaceTime with Jack. He likes to get ready with me. Actually, no, I force him to get ready with me. So yeah, I'm gonna do a little bit of skincare, a little bit of makeup, you know, just get ready. I'll see you guys when I'm ready. It's like 11 and I told myself that I would leave the house at 10.30. We're finally leaving the house. It's literally 12 p.m. I still have to go to Mimi's to pick up all the Zara clothes that are at her house for this video, but I have all of my other shit like packed up. Let's go. I'm at my sister's now. I set up, it literally took me so long to set up because like the lighting just wasn't really working. But now I think I like, I figured it out, I think. And I like it, I think. So yeah, I'm gonna film this haul right now. I like, need to relax a little bit because I'm stressing for some reason. We're just sitting by this couch and admiring the view. Let me show you it. This my view, this the setup, this room literally is a mess. Haley, what is going on? I'm honestly really proud of my eyeliner today. You guys don't understand. I literally have been practicing my eyeliner for like a couple months now and today was the first time where I literally just like did it in like three seconds and it just looked perfect and I was like, oh. The 10,000 rule does work. Although, I mean, I don't know if I spent 10,000 hours <laughs> trying to do eyeliner. Maybe in like my whole lifetime. Probably not. Honestly, actually though, when you think about it, maybe. Maybe. I actually want to look that up. Like how much of your life, how much does an average girl, how much time does an average girl spend in their lifetime doing their eyeliner? I want to know. I want to know the statistic. Anyway, okay, I'm gonna go film now, I swear. I promise. Film that whole shebang. I'm going to head out right now. I packed everything up. My parents are already downstairs. They came to downtown with me. I bet they're gonna make me drive. I really hope not because I'm not down. <laughs> anyway, let's see if I can carry all this shit by myself. Gotta go, gotta blast. <laughs> I'm about to collapse right now. I'm literally going to like break. Huh. Hey guys, it's currently, why the fuck is it seven? It, why is it something 22? Every time I look at the clock, every time I've looked at the clock today, it's been like something 22 and it's freaking me out and it's 722 right now. I'm in need of a little me time. I'm in need of a little, I need a, I'm so sorry for cutting myself short, but do you see that license plate? <laughs> This is what I'm talking about. You see, it follows us everywhere. Anyway, I'm in need of a little me time. I need to like, just think a little bit right now. So I'm going on a drive. Actually, I'm driving to a view. Look at my view. I love LA. 
I love LA. I'm gonna go watch the sunset by myself on a Saturday night because that's exactly what I need right now. And I'm just so thankful that I'm able to do that. Here I am at our view. It's quite nice. This is the city of Beverly Hills. This is the city of Beverly Hills. You know, like normally I do this with my friends, but um, we're sticking alone tonight. I'm honestly glad. I'm gonna go enjoy my moment of silence. <laughs> Just enjoy my peace. I'll get back to you, you know, like when I get home and I'm not like feeling wonky in the head. just got home. I have a shitload of homework to do and I know I'm not gonna have time tomorrow because it's Mother's Day and then I also have a bar mitzvah so I'm gonna have no time. Therefore, I shall start doing some of my homework today. Normally Sundays are my homework days but we're gonna have to do some things a little different. It is 11.42 p.m. I did like homework and you know school related stuff. I'm gonna go to bed. It's Mother's Day tomorrow, bro. I didn't get my mom anything yet. I mean my sister got her glasses. I don't know if we're gonna like do a duo thing and say that I was a part of that. Don't know if that's gonna happen. I've been trying out this new teeth whitening pen. I think it's working. <laughs> I didn't it looks kind of freaky, like that Ross episode. Like that Friends episode with Ross. Anyway, I'm rambling. I'm gonna go to bed is what I'm trying to say. I'll see you guys in the morning. Hey y'all, I'm so sorry that I just didn't vlog my entire morning. I mean, it's only 12 p.m. I mean, I didn't really do anything. Okay, let me, let me give y'all a rundown on what has happened. So please like, don't look at that mess right now. Just don't, please don't. So I woke up at nine because, well, yeah, today's Mother's Day, it's Sunday. And I woke up at nine. We supposedly had brunch reservations at 10.30 and I get ready, I wake up, like I shower, do my makeup, put on my clothes, whatever. And then I call my sister at like 10.15 and I'm like, hello, like you're not responding to my text, what's up? And then she's like, oh, lol, forgot to tell you. We moved them to 2.30. So I was not really given a heads up, which would have been nice, but it's okay. Like she called, apologize, it's fine. So now my plans kind of shifted. I was originally gonna go to brunch, homework, then get ready for this bar mitzvah. So now instead I did homework, brunch, get ready for a bar mitzvah. And I'm so glad that I actually did it this way because now I'm like stress-free. I've done my homework. I literally had to take a practice AP, like a practice AP lit test. I had to write three fucking essays it was so not it, like, I, it was so not it. It's not something that I wanted to do in the morning, but I'm just glad I got it over with. I should have like done a time lapse of me like stressing writing this essay. I'm going to eat breakfast because I haven't done that yet. But then again, like I'm also gonna eat brunch. Well, that's not really brunch, bro. That's like lunch. That's full on, that's not a brunch, that's a lunch. Okay, so there is that. Anyway, let's go eat breakfast right now because I need to eat. And then I'll probably clean up my room. Dad, hey. Whoa, that was kind of good. Um, anyway, I'm trying to figure out a place to put you guys. I haven't done my gratitude today. So go get your pen and paper, get your notebook. Let's do it together. I'm literally gonna wait for you to get your shit because I talk about this all the time. And I figured if I Leave a little space for you to go and do this, then you will. So go get your piece of paper and your pen. Okay, great. I'm assuming you have it by now. Just write down anything you're grateful for. Today is Mother's Day, so I would say I'm grateful for my mother, but I, that was like the second thing I wrote down in this notebook. And I'm trying to not repeat. So let's say something different, but kind of the same. Okay, we did it. See, it's like literally takes a second. Like all you have to do is write a sentence and don't just write down like what you're grateful for. Literally write, I'm grateful for. My sister just texted me saying she's on her way. So now we're just gonna wait for her to get here. Hey, mother with her flowers. Hey, <laughs> 
Manyak kızım benim gel buraya. Yok. <gülüyor> ah, oh, so perfect. Do you like it? Oy. Why are they just looking at it instead of eating? <laughs> Update. What time is it? Five. It's five. We left Elefante. That's where we were for brunch. I got home. I changed into like the clothes I'm gonna wear for this bar mitzvah. And now I'm at Mimi's where she needs to get ready. I know. Like stat so we can go. Cause it's literally across the street. I mean I'm I'm good. I'll get ready in like 20, 30 minutes. No. No. What? That's too long. Yeah. The ladies. What's the three second change? Tarzan type of shit. Mm. And they're ready, ready? Ooh. Ooh. Why does this give me anxiety? What? Don't she look at her? Look at Twenty Panda. Yeah, you guys are matching. No. Why aren't you part of the squad? <laughs> <laughs> I love you. got home from the bar mitzvah. It was a blast. I should probably also tell you guys that I'm fully vaccinated. I don't think that's something that I mentioned earlier in the video, but your girl's fully vaxxed. We got Pfizer. It's 12.15 a.m. I go home. I'm so tired. My feet hurt so much because we were dancing literally the entire night and I ate a blue lollipop. I'm gonna go take my makeup off, get undressed, do that whole shebang but before i do i want to say good night to you guys thank you so much for watching this weekend vlog i really liked this honestly when i have more like fun weekends i'm gonna start vlogging them because this was kind of like fun i love you so much stay safe good night <laughs>